gonna. I knew this was gonna happen. The mother of a pregnant teenager killed by her boyfriend Saturday morning says it was no surprise. Tonight she's talking with 24 Hour News 8's Leon Hendricks as her daughter's accused killer prepares for his first appearance in court on murder charges. His latest bout of violence, police say, two lives taken, one before a day on earth. Courtney Delano was 19, due to have a son in less than five months. Baby just said, kick the rally out and he need more room. It was here at the Walnut Trail Apartments in Portage that she was shot in the chest and killed. Police say Roland Marco was the trigger man. She loved him. She loved him so much. The murder came as less than a shock to Courtney's mother. You're saying you knew that he would kill her? Yes, I did. It was about four months ago after one in a pattern of fights between Courtney and Roland that she had what now seems to be a bit of a premonition. I looked at my friend and I said, he's going to kill her and there's nothing I can do about it. As tragic as this is, it's not as shocking. Marcos now here, charged at the Kalamazoo County Jail. He's being held without bond, but it's surely not the first time he's been here. Some background online, six pages, assaults, and several other crimes. His latest in April, domestic violence and assaulting an officer were the original charges. The domestic was dropped. He pled guilty to assaulting the officer and was sentenced to six months probation and released. Hours later, he would killed the woman who was preparing to mother his son. I knew this was going to happen. But she said she felt there was nothing she could do, decided to respect her daughter's decision to continue dating Marco. The only other option, she said, to try forcing her away from the man she loved. Then she, you know, rebels and she, he gets all of her. A message to the man police say is now a killer. No sorries are going to bring her back. Do the right thing. Don't drag this out. Just finally show her you love her too. His first time before a judge on these charges tomorrow. In Portage, Leon Hendricks, 24-Hour News 8.